Burnt me. Hey guys. Hey y'all. We are grocery shopping and trying to be responsible adults. I don't know if you can hear the music, but it's my homeland up in here. Yo, he's happy as fuck right now. <laughs> Help us figure out noodles. There's noodles for days. All the noodles. And if anyone knows how to make fidel, comment. But down we below and help us because I don't, don't remember. <laughs> we know what it is. We don't want to call our mothers in shame and be like, So, how do you make that one Mexican dish we've been eating all our lives? Let's see what happened. Was <laughs> I forgot. We got some farfalli, we got some fideo, we got a bunch of grains. We were shopping like we're gonna die soon. Do you like mac and cheese? Uh, I'm black. Do I like mac and cheese? <laughs> I don't need you telling me where a bear shits in the buckwheat. <laughs> do not ever pay for these. What you do is you get a whole pack of tortillas that weighs like four pounds and it's only gonna be like 69 cents and then you just fry them up yourself. You got tortillas for days and chips for days. It's my homeland, guys. Look. Can we get Ritz? And the canned easy cheese? You Don't look judge really, me. really happy about this. <laughs> Don't judge me. I'm being judged. That is all the judgment right there. That's a I fat kid walk of shame right there. <laughs> I tend to do this thing where I steal everybody's food and then promise to buy them more later. Except it's been like a month and we haven't gone grocery shopping. So I keep saying, yeah, 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 when we go, I'll totally get you some more stuff. <laughs> all right, guys. So I'm not here to tell you how to live your lives. But if you are picking up a case of Jumex, you should probably not. That's some fat kid walk of shame right there. You are fucking hiding yourself. Jesus Christ. Look at this wall of heart attacks. Pray with me because Sister DJ has found yet another temptation. <laughs> Look at all of these. They're everywhere. There's mango. I don't give a fuck about mango. You saying that because I'm brown? That looks really... <laughs> Though I walk through the valley of shadow of sugary beverages, I will fear no Jumex. Here they go again. Guys. Not even six feet away from the ones over there. Guys, the next step is having them in the little pouches. That's the next step. That's nasty. Jumex. Jumex is going nowhere. nowhere. Hey! First of all, can you do it like this is an aerator? Okay. And it's to make that Mexican hot chocolate inside the hot chocolate. That's awesome. I know. Why is there separate like rings? Or is it to just to aerate it? To froth it. This one's broken though at the top. It's probably how it got broken. Almost tortilla press. And his daddy's right there. The whole family's here. Jesus Christ. And you have this lovely tortilla press. She's nicely varnished and beautifully colored. It's a nice, heavy 10 pound. Don't throw it! <laughs> no, I got we are back and Nick has let the Mexican out. We're done <laughs> shopping and we got a whole lot of crap and a whole lot of stuff. We really like cheese, apparently. I'm a fruit fanatic. Oh, so Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.